Just when Hollywood thought it was making progress in the second largest movie market in the world, an all-out trade war is on between Washington, D.C. and Beijing. I'm doing this to do the right thing for our country. We have been ripped off by China for a long time. The deepening tensions between the U.S. and China are cause for even deeper concerns in Hollywood, which has grown to rely on Chinese moviegoers and investors with deep pockets. Before the trade war began, both countries were negotiating new terms to increase the number of American films imported to China from 34 to around 50. An increase in revenue share for U.S. studios was also on the table. Currently, it's 25 percent, while the international norm is 40 to 50 percent. For producer Robert Kane, who works in both China and the U.S., the escalating trade war could turn very painful. Unfortunately for me, it's not. Theoretical. It's very real. I have business going on uh, now where I'm raising money from China, as I've done for quite a few years. And the deals that I'm working on, while we're still moving ahead, they've really been uh, uh, crimped by uh, the, the Chinese government's reaction to what's going on, by fear on the part of the Chinese investors that I'm working with. Although the trade war would hit Hollywood a lot harder, Chinese entertainment companies aren't resting easy. To trade war, will not have a winner. Everyone will hurt. It really just matter who hurt most. But there may actually be a silver lining to this rift for China's movie industry. Perhaps uh, it will benefit the film industry in terms of how to really nurture domestic talent. Um, so that is that is one consequence, and and maybe it will accelerate the uh, development of these, you know projects to the point they'll be more marketable to the outside world. People will take a beat and say, okay, let's really work on quality. But at this point, the reality is there's still a very big trade imbalance. China imports a lot more movies than it exports. For example, the highest grossing Chinese film in North America last year was Wolf Warrior II, which pulled in just $2.7 million. Hollywood's biggest film in China was The Fate of the Furious, which made nearly $393 million. So, needless to say, the U.S. film industry will be the bigger loser if this trade war keeps heating up. Mei Li, CGTN, Hollywood.